The North Dakota Health and Human Services is funding health care facilities across our state to help combat the opioid epidemic. During the 2023 legislative session, lawmakers in North Dakota passed ND Century Code 50-36. The Opioid Settlement Advisory Committee was created under this code and was granted $8 million from the Opioid Settlement Fund to Health and Human Services. For the years of 23 to 2025, 20 percent of these funds must be used for the prevention of opioids and overdoses. Out of 65 applicants across the state, 14 agencies will receive funding for this program. These dollars will help put strategies in place to both prevent individuals from um, developing an opioid use disorder in the first place um, and also helping support those individuals who may be struggling, really to help save lives. Some of the 14 recipients include Endeavor Sober Living, the Hartview Foundation, and the Dis First District Health Unit. In February, the Opioid Settlement Committee will begin do dole doling out the money to those who received the grant, but first the agencies are required to sit down with the advisory committee and explain how they will use the funds. However, this could really change things for those who struggle with addiction in our state. In 2023, the preliminary data does show a decrease in the number of individuals who died from opioid overdose compared to 2022. And so we're hoping that we're bringing change and that the, this funding and these efforts will continue to see that change. Anderson says that there is a potential that during the next legislative session, there could be additional funds allocated from the opioid settlement funds. She also says that even though there were agencies that were not awarded, they still provide resources to everyone in the state related to opioid overdoses. You can find more information on that by looking for this story on our website, kxnet.com.